Now, eight elected local government council chairman Biosal received certificates of return following the local government and councillorship election held on April the 6th, 2024. Dr. Uh, Dr. Peter Singabel, uh, chairman of Bios State Independent uh, Electoral Commission, uh, stated that the presentation of certificates is the final stage of the commission's duty. This is a brief ceremony, but very important. But this is the last step on the part of ICF in the 2024 elections. When you have your certificates and when eventually are sworn in, you can now operate as elected chairman of eight local government areas. And that is the third tier of government, the democratic setup at the grassroots. Now, some uh, chairmen, after receiving the certificates, have pledged to fulfill their campaign promises by investi investing in projects that benefit their councils. I'm going to make sure that the local areas are turned to urban areas by provision of uh, 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 amenities, social amenities. I'm going to touch the lives of the people. Physically, they will know that things have changed. You know, you women, we are peculiar in doing things. I'm going to involve money to the girl child, training of the girl child. I've looked for this thing for over the years. I know that I have something to offer. And now that I've been given the opportunity by the special grace of God, I know that certain job people will see good governance, bringing the government closer to the people, good hospitals, good schools. Mopokma, we have arable lands where people can work. We are going to encourage agriculture. We are going to engage in youth development through trainings. Yeah, there are a lot of skills that our youth can learn and then make a living for themselves. That will take them off the streets. So we are going to engage in youth training and retraining. We are also going to engage in sports. Sports is another place that can take our youth. Today we have a lot of uh, uh, international champions, you know, both football, wrestling, swimming. So we are going to also engage our youth in sports programs. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.